20-year-old Demetrius Sarantopoulos from Greece against the Belfast boy, 25-year-old Darren McMullen. Sarantopoulos might be five years younger, but he has a very impressive fight record. 30 fights, 29 wins so far, and just the one loss. Darren McMullen's fight record, well, he's only had 12 fights, but he's won eight of them and drawn two. <laughs> Belfast man, or Bally Gowan to be exact. The Bally Gowan man is uh, quite a bit taller than his opponent and uh, looks as though he should have a, a longer reach as well. It might help him out. Certainly those big long legs should be able to put in some very good kicks. Well, right away McMullen getting into action. Tattooed McMullen just trying to find his range, I think, with those long kicks. Certainly paying off. Well, that, that was a big slip. Sarantopoulos saying that uh, his glove was coming loose, or his right, left, or his left glove was coming loose there. But McMullen moving back into the attack again. The last thing McMullen needs is to be caught in the close-up stuff like that. He should keep his distance, use his reach, use those legs, that's it. And keep out of the corner. End of round one. Pretty good round. Sarantopoulos started uh, kickboxing when he was just 11 years old. And he's been at it ever since. Yeah, just a little bit of holding going on there. And once again, McMullen's mixing it at close range I still think he'd be better hanging off a bit I think that's what Billy Murray is saying to him too, stay out, stay out There's no doubt the man from Greece is a pretty solid puncher. McMullen's gum shield has come out and uh, Billy Murray's giving it a rinse before it goes back in again. Pretty clever fight from uh, Sir Antopoulos because he's, every opportunity he's getting in close, 
McMullen can't use his range, his reach, his big legs. Oh no, the Greek is really landing some punishment. Both fighters ending up in a heap. Neither man getting a decisive punch in there. And there's the end of the round. Well, you have to say that uh, the Greek is looking pretty confident at the moment, Saronpopoulos. Now that's better from McMullen. Now he needs to just get away from the close stuff once he lands those attacks. Use the ring. Gary, just a quick point. That was an illegal technique. Three knees in a row. One, two, three. You're not allowed that. This is Oriental rules. One hold, one knee. That's it. You may well see Bob Hunter come in and penalise Demetrius for that. Murray's trying to encourage Darren McMullen to go for low kicks, but the message isn't getting through at the moment. Turning into a real war of attrition here, a real slugfest. Well, there was a good right hand. That one worked, and it's opened up a big cut on the, the side of the Greek face. Sarantopoulos is definitely badly cut there. And that, I don't think he's going to be able to continue. He's going to have to see the doctor here and get his opinion. I think that cut is right above his eye. Now, doctor's going to stop it. It's not going to continue. It is all over. The cut is too bad. to step into the ring. Mr. McMullen, please. Well, this European title fight had to be stopped on medical advice. Unfortunately, Dimitris Sarantopoulos too badly cut to continue. So to present the belt to the new European champion, Darren McMullen.
Open this. for our special guest tonight, Stephen Cabrera, the president of WKN, and Mr. Ernesto Hoos. We're going to final word with Ernesto just before he disappears. Have you been impressed with tonight's fight, Bill? Uh, I've seen uh, some nice fights. I, I saw all the fighters actually showed great heart, and I think that is uh, what, what the fight is about. I mean... Uh, when you come to the fight, you want to see some excitement. Am I right or not? Yeah. So I think you saw a lot of ex excitement tonight, so I think everybody can be satisfied. Okay, thank you very much for coming back to Belfast once more. Ernesto, who's...